Hey guys, welcome to another Battle Royale video. So, apparently, just like one or two hours ago, the developers released a new mode that's called Distance Battle. So, I haven't played it yet. As you can see, my average position there is zero. And we're gonna check it out right away and see if it's an April, April Fool's joke or not, because... I think it's not, but I'm not 100% convinced yet, but it should be. Um, so, first of all, Mapper provided some interesting information here that says in this game mode you have to guess your location on the map like in regular GeoGuessr games and the player who guessed the farthest is eliminated. Instead of lives, we have a certain amount of guesses we can do, five by default, and we can guess multiple times by, per round to reduce our error distance. The only way to be eliminated is to make the worst guess, so only one player can be eliminated per round, so all games will last around 10 minutes. Which sounds like it could be a little bit longer than the average other B BR game. The error distance between your guess and the certain location it's, is never shown outside of the round result screen. Instead, it will display the distances between your guess and the guesses of the two players around you. That, when I first read it, sounds weird. The one in front and the one after you, except if you're in first or last position. Not sure yet how to understand this, but we will find out. I mean... It sounds a little bit weird, but yeah, I have an idea what it could be. You could try to get closer from your opponent by making your guesses, but there is a cooldown of five seconds between each guess. Uh, so don't wait too long, otherwise you'll be stuck in cooldown while the timer runs out. The best guess is kept, so don't worry about making another guess that can be not correct at all. Uh, it sounds a little bit weird at first, but I mean, you don't have endless lives, so yeah. Each new round will give you an additional guess to avoid having no guests left, makes sense. And you can get extra guesses by being close, by finding the correct country, by using one single guess. Okay, one single guess rewards you that's pretty interesting it is advised to save your guesses in the first rounds to have more guesses in the last rounds okay i mean that's his personal opinion which sounds reasonable but yeah i'm not sure if it's played or so much to actually be able to tell it already so we'll see the division system is the same as the br so you have your current rank, however, the position ratio is separated. So what he means, I think, is you have your current level. And the, the position, as we can see here, is separated, the average. But it's not separated on your profile. I already saw that. I'm not sure what's going to happen here. Maybe nothing. Maybe that's not implemented yet. I'm, I don't know. However, the position ratio is separated. Uh, I didn't see any power-ups in this new game mode, which is good point. Overall, it's nice to play. I like it more than the country mode. All right. Yeah, I have to say, I think it sounds, first of all, it sounds better. The only thing that I could see is a problem is having too much time to guess and if there's like a restaurant around people googling it that is from what i read down here somewhere uh, sounds like it's the only problem really so let's see who we gonna find um yeah and play one or two rounds yeah, we'll see how long they take. A lot of gold players. Looks kind of like Portugal, Spain here, I think. 
I'm not sure. Cordovina. Not sure if it's br um I could all I mean unlikely Brazil, but not impossible. Heads up you're in last place. Oh okay. What now? You've made it. Okay, so it shows you So the, the person in front is one Oh man, that's crazy actually. So th this person is 125 kilometer better than I am and this person behind me is 85 less. It looks like I'm good enough so I don't want to waste my life if I understand correctly how this works. Because you get one additional lives always, sometimes even more. So I don't want to, yeah. Now I have six lives, six lives because I got two additional. Um, where was it? Oh wow, now we can see where it was. It was southern Portugal. And, oh, this looks ki kind of sameish. Wait, why can I move? What? 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 Why can I move? Isn't it no moving? I thought it's no moving. What? Can you usually move? Wait, I'm confused. Or is it... Is it... Eh? Can you move? Maybe I didn't get it right. So it should be France. I mean, if I can move, then... Where's A9? I thought it's no moving. No? Maybe maybe I want to believe it's no moving, but it's actually not. Where is A9? Freaking hell. I have no idea where A9 is. Probably a smaller one, even though it's a small number. I don't know. Where is A9? And now I have seven lives. It's getting crazier. Um... It was down here, southern France this time. We can't really move. I thought it's no moving. I would have preferred that. Wait, is this Bhutan? This, um, these things make me think Bhutan, but I'm not 100% convinced because Sometimes uh, Bhutan is a little bit, yeah, but I mean, the truck looks, certainly looks weird. So don't guess too late, that's what I was told. Yeah, I'm in the lead. <laughs> 480 meters in front. So do I also get an extra life if I'm the best? Uh, I'm not sure anymore. Let's see. So this will mean I would get nine lives after or eight wait let me think eight or nine i don't know yeah i got nine nice <laughs> i'm collecting lives this is fun no one's got more than six lives man this is really fun lanka ashok <laughs> yeah this is sri lanka then I mean, I think it is. It's quite mountainous down here somewhere. The road is east-west, so it could be maybe this road. But all the lives do not help me with anything if I finish last, right? But I can see my exact position, so if I'm second now, I feel very safe, right? So I'm being rewarded for making instant good guesses. And that, I think, is very important. And that's working very well, I think, as far as I can tell so far. Okay, I got the 11 lives. Even better. And what is this interesting walling here? 
looks like some safety um, thing. You can move, that's so weird. I thought it's no moving. That would have been way nicer, no? Maybe it's a bug. I, w I have to check afterward. Um, this is obviously either Lesotho. Yeah, it feels very Lesotho. Uh, how can I be sure? How can I be sure? Where's the rope going? Let's try this. <laughs> I'm first. Okay. Man, this is really good. This is really fun. Holy shit. They did this really well, I think. I mean, it's early to tell, but... And like, people are not so good, it seems. Like, these locations were all quite easy. And these are gold people. So, I don't know. They struggle a lot. <laughs> wow, I was so freaking close. Uh, here you can see the lives that I gain. <laughs> oh, this could be Denmark or Sweden. Let's see language. Oh. I all I see snow. Wait, it's we cruise persuasion. Uh sounds I'm not sure what it sounds like. So I don't need to hurry, right? I don't need to hurry actually if I feel quite certain. I mean I can hurry, but I don't need to be the last not the last guessing, right? I think it's Denmark. Oh wow, I'm not close. Um, wait, what did I say? Then it's probably Sweden. Oh shit, and it's higher. No, 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 no. Ah, that's what Mapper meant by don't wait too long. So there is a reason not to wait. <laughs> I was so focused on collecting lives, but this strategy is not so good either. Ah, that, but, that, but it's really interesting. You really need to consider both. Like you want more lives, but you also um, cannot let the time run out. So it's, yeah, yeah, pretty interesting. Uh, let's see, one more. Yeah, one more. One more. Video is 13 minutes. Oh, what is going on? What? Seems to be buggy. Oh no. The first time I got in, it went pretty fast. Oh, there's a pepper player. Nice. Rangers. Maybe not so many players at uh, at this time. Plus, because it's new, maybe people don't check it out. I don't know. Maybe they don't like it. But why is it moving? Why can't they not make it no moving? Wait, now I have a 50-50 all of a sudden? What? Huh? Wait, is this the same game mode? What? Maybe... Wait, that's weird. Wait, why am I now in this mode? Yeah, well, okay. Uh, why am I in this mode now? But okay, we will play. I did press play again and apparently they have not linked that button correctly, I think. <laughs> That's funny. Or it was a bug, but I don't think so. <laughs> We're gonna play one round of this and then another one of... Uh... Or maybe if they don't, if there are not enough players, you get dropped into normal thing. I don't know. Maybe. That would be weird though. Let's go. Come on, hurry up. I don't want to spend forever on this one. 
Uh, whoa. Whoa, what is this? Sun. Interesting. Interesting. Black car? Black car. Is it Argentina? No, it's not Argentina. Mexico? No, not Mexico. Whoa. What the heck is this location? Um, I'm confused, to be honest. Wait. Oh, Peru Paul? Is it Peru? Yeah, I think so. Okay, Peru like this. Interesting landscape for Peru. Really weird. Like, usually it's dry or green now, but not like this. Huh. And they have black car? I didn't know. Mm. And I won't be able to memorize that for long. <laughs> so. Ah, my phone. Always. El Carmen. This is also quite... I think this font is not used so much. Is this Switzerland? No, it's Norway. Yeah, like, yeah, signs like this. Norway, no other possibility, I think. Ooh, interesting hedge. Makes me think like Ireland, maybe Wales. Too much Geo Wizard thoughts. Um, I'm gonna try Ireland. Otherwise, yeah, it is Ireland. Could have tried the UK as well, but yeah, this feels more Irish. Just, I don't know why. Just because I guess those hedges, you see them more in Ireland and less. UK can have quite some different landscapes, but um, yellow plate. Uh, is this UK? Kind of looks like position of the road sign. Very UK thing, I think. It's such a weird position that they sometimes play, place it in. Uh-oh, what is this? Shangri-La? It's the hotel and we're in an amusement park. Oh, wait, Japanese? Is that Jap... No, that's Russian. So either Russia or Ukraine. No! You freaking... What else? Bulgaria? Uh, Mongolia? It doesn't look like Bulgaria, I think. Oh. I have no idea. Interesting. The hotel is called Shangri-La. That's so weird for a Russian speaking country. Really weird place. I would love to see where this is because I won't find it. I'm not gonna guess, just go next round. I hope the others don't guess, because I don't know what it could be. I mean, Bulgaria, I don't know. It's a photosphere, Mongolia, I don't know. I don't know, man. Park, mm, English letters, that makes it even weirder. It was Mongolia, I was knocked out. Yeah, whatever, whatever, I guess. So can I play the normal? No, not the normal, but this one. One more time. Let's hope it works. Obama is in this game. <laughs> nice. He's in the Discord. Oh no, not something like that. <laughs> that must be India. It looks like locations feel very similar. 
Also very nice that this warning is. Maybe it shouldn't be up in the first two seconds or so, but I mean, maybe I shouldn't wait too long. Should I? Hmm. Two people behind me. This guy already has zero lives, so he cannot guess again, right? So I'm not scared of dropping out, so no need to do anything crazy. Save up lives. But I definitely need to be less careful, I think. And not wait so long. So it's actually not that bad, because if you wait long and you try to Google stuff, this must be Finland with this kind of white signs. Um, let's find the city. I think we can do it. Uh, Ivaskila? Ivaskila, somewhere close to Ivaskila. The 20, the 4, uh, where is the 20? That is, maybe this is the 20. The 4, 20 and 22. And Ivaskila is maybe east. But we don't know. 20, 20. Oh, I need to guess maybe. I should have guessed earlier. But I'm 28 kilometers away, so um, it's one of these towns here. Or maybe even Ivaskila. But I don't think it wouldn't be signed, right? In Finland, they wouldn't sign it. Wait. What? Ah, the, the person was 28 kilometers behind me. It was actually Ulu, the Ari town, where fucking Ari is from. Uh, well, yeah, I mean, obviously, Indonesia or Malaysia. But... Can we get a flag, maybe? That would be nice. That's all I'm asking for, really. Um, but not in such populated areas. There is no place for flags here. Mm. Balai Kota, I don't know, Jakarta. So it must be Indonesia. Let's try here. Let's try Java. Eh, good enough for now, at least. Not much time left, so I feel pretty safe here. Could be Jakarta itself, actually. Wow, that's a nice building. Or maybe not. I don't know. Looks kind of weird as well. It was Bandung. Ah, oh, okay. And this looks like Balkan, but I don't know. Maybe North Macedonia. Maybe Albania. Well, yes, yes, yes. Uh, we have Cyrillic plus so that will make sense for North Macedonia. Any oil name here? Wait, what? What is the petrol name? Bunar. I don't know Bunar. Petrol. But I'm fairly sure we are somewhere in this, not necessarily this country, but possibly in this country. <laughs> Let's see. So it takes quite the skill to be close with your initial guess. I really like that. Oh man. Scary. Only two people. Whew. <laughs> that was risky. I could have tried to improve it, but... Oh, what is this? Red railing with white. That's so weird. It kind of feels like Botswana, but um, yeah, it feels like Botswana. And it's the Nche River, and it feels like Botswana. Definitely. 
gonna try it looks quite dry so what does that mean the road is going let's try up here mm, it's not so good it's not so good let's try over here okay closer now <laughs> that's actually such a good game mode like even you get the right country you get really close it you can still drop out What does red mean? Is red just showing the person that drops out? Probably, but I'm not sure. It was up here, close to Zimbabwe. That is so dry there, interesting. And what is this? Interesting kind of a median. I don't know this place really. It, it reminds me of Greece actually. It reminds me of Greece. Greasy Greece. We're gonna try that and see if it's bad or not. Oh, it's not good. <laughs> not at all. What else could it be? Wait, let me. Oh, it's Turkey. It's freaking Eastern Turkey, probably. I got better, but still not good. Oh, wait, it could be Jordan. Yeah, it is Jordan. Okay, interesting. First time I had to guess three times to actually get the right country. I hope it's good enough. Um, Norway? Maybe Finland? Maybe... I don't know. Oh, this looks very Swedish. This font looks very Swedish. Hammarstrand. The 87 and the 323. It's definitely Sweden. The 87. It's actually nice that you can actually look for road numbers. And you have the time for it. Hamastrand. Is it maybe over here? No? 323. Let's see. I don't know. It feels very southern, I think. But I should probably improve. Let's see. Oh, it's probably not up there. Oh, it is actually up there. <laughs> okay. Oh, there's Hammerstrand. Oh, wow, it's not even that small. Interesting that I don't know it, because I know a lot of Swedish town names. Interesting. There is Hammerstrand. It was in Skogen. And this IA sounds like a Slavic language. Futbolo Akademia Siauliu. Wait, L LT, that's Lietuva. Wait, LV is Latvia, right. It's near Taurage and Panevsi is, where's Taurage again? Panevsi is here, where's Taurage? Hmm, where's Taurage? I know it's like not so small. Where is the freaking Taurag? I don't know. Is it closer here? Who made it? Last one, and I have 13 lives. So I should really guess fast. It look this house makes me think Indonesia. Also this wall. Or something like in Asia. We're gonna try Java first. Let's go. And then we're gonna explore. Huh. It is Indonesia, I think. <laughs> I 
I mean, 2,000 kilometers in front of him. <laughs> well, so the question is, yeah, it is very likely to be Indonesia. But where? Oh, Indonesia, why are you such a nightmare? He's still very far away. Oh, now he's only 300. Ooh. I should actually try to make better guesses. Wait, he overtook me. Holy shit. Oh. So, I made a mistake there, not understanding how this works. Even though I got a decent guess in first, I should have still continued to um, put in guesses. Because it takes your best guess, if I remember Mapper's um, description correctly. It always takes your best guess. So if you try 10 times and your first try is the best, you can still try 10 times. At least I think. I'm not 100% sure because I didn't try it. And it's like you cannot see exactly, right? So, But I think it's going to work this way. So... Yeah, that's it. No win so far. Um, but yeah, I, I guess it needs some understanding. It, it it needs a little bit more strategy, it seems, than the other game mode. But I think uh, Mapper is overall right to um, save the lives for later. But you have to really use them then and not keep them. Like, for what? That's what I did wrong, apparently. Obviously. So, um, yeah, I mean, I mean, you can move around, apparently. Is it really? Did, was that just something in my mind that the new game mode would be no moving? But it is actually not. <laughs> it doesn't say anywhere. But, yeah, I hope it's no April Fool's mode, but because I also think that this game mode is better than the normal Battle Royale. Whether it's no moving or moving, um, I think it doesn't matter that much, but it definitely would be nice to have no moving mode. But le wait, let me check. What did, what did they say about cheating? It becomes substantially easier to cheat. Ah, he says that because close guesses. Okay, yeah, but at least it's it's like, ah, yeah, I know what he means. Yeah, that's actually a problem. But yeah, I guess. Um, yeah, it, it, yeah, I guess I think it would be better if it would be no moving at least. Yeah, I think that would be better. Maybe. I mean, would be still have to try it out, but it feels like if you can move, you can just find a shop and Google that. Unless it's like a different language. <laughs> then you can screw it. But a different f like uh, alphabet. So yeah, that's it. First time. First time, no wins. But it is really fun. You should check it out too. So let me know if there's any questions and uh, yeah, thanks for watching guys. Feel free to subscribe if you want to see more sometime. Plus the Reddit League will be starting very soon. I will cover that, my games in Division 2 still trying to survive. So thanks for watching guys. See you guys. Bye bye.